Hey, a pleasant good day, everybody. This is Sports Side News. I'm Joe Bork, and this is going to be our next goaltender video. This is going to be on Jack Campbell getting five years, five million per as after emerging this year with the Toronto Maple Leafs after being basically behind the scenes um, with the Kings for many years. Jack Campbell now is going to be the starter for the Edmonton Oilers as the Oilers think they got their man. They got a guy that is not 43 years old <laughs> to uh, be their goaltender. He's just 30. He's going to be at the end of his age 35 season. And I would also think the Oilers aren't done with goaltending. I would think they would bring in a backup as well. Since right now, excuse me, behind Campbell, it would be Stuart Skinner. And we both, not we both, we all know the biggest issue with Jack Campbell is not skill and how he's able to play. It's how healthy is he able to be to play the amount of games you want him to play. And to me, if Jack Campbell was healthy, $5 million is maybe a bit high for him. Being the B level, B plus level goaltender, he's not necessarily, in, he's definitely not necessarily in that full elite category, but he's in that very good category when he's on his game. But if he can stay healthy and string together seasons of 40-plus games, I think it will become worth it. The only reason I say it might be high is because I just use the word if, where there's other guys that are more of a definite out there when you pay them the $5 million bucks that they're going to be able to get you the amount of games you want them to get you, so to speak. Excuse me. Um, but I think this move, it's a risk for the Edmonton Oilers in the sense of Campbell's health is a concern in terms of his long-term durability, in terms of him being a full-blown starter, which obviously he's going to be there getting paid $5 million. But I would say it's a risk that, other than if they also went out and got Darcy Kemper, who got paid a little bit more than Jack Campbell uh, four or five years as well, he got 5.25. It seemed like they were going to go with one or two guys that were two of the bigger guys on the market, both of these two bigger guys in the marketing, Kemper and Campbell, have injury history and durability history. So it's kind of just pick your poison between the two. He played almost 50 games this year, ended up still getting banged up in the end. But I think Campbell, because he doesn't have as much wear and tear on him throughout his career, on top of Kemper, who was just thrown at shot after shot during his time in Arizona and really stood on his head there, has more wear and tear on his body. I would say they picked the right guy between the two to be able to have a better chance of having more durability during the five-year stretch of the contract. So I would have to say for that, I would give them like a B-plus on this contract because I think that's in a good grade. I, like I said, I think Campbell's a good goaltender. I like him a lot as a goalie, but I put him more in that B category of goaltender. So the signing is a B-plus with potential to grow because Campbell, uh, if he can stay healthy, he can be damn good. But you don't want to always be saying if for that. And I think for him, it's not as huge of a concern as Kemper just because he hasn't had some of that's because of his injuries, but he hasn't had as much wear on his body. So now if he can start to stay healthy, this will kind of be his waken, awakening in the league when he actually becomes a full-blown starter. He was that last year with Toronto, and now he's going to be that, obviously, with Edmonton. So we're going to have to see when it comes to health. Other than that, I see Jack Campbell having success in Edmonton when he's healthy. It's just, hopefully, that can continue. And the way that's going to continue for Campbell is Edmonton adding defense. And now, after they got their goaltender, my biggest key for Edmonton for the rest of this offseason is, especially after they also signed Evander Kane and re-signed him, defense, 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 damn it, focus on defense. Peace out, everybody. Stay safe. Please give us a subscribe down below.